All right, people, how's it going? My name is Big Mooney, and we are back on Hitman 3 today. And this is some of the stuff that we've got to look forward to over the course of March. They've done some changes to the elusive Target Arcade, so I'm going to check out some of that today. But also, they're going to support contracts on the Patient Zero map, so that's, that's pretty cool, you know? Th those maps get kind of forgotten about because... It's literally just the main missions that exist on them. Like, that's been the case for the last like five years. So yeah, probably get some contracts going from you guys on those maps in the future. And we're also getting some featured contracts, all right? It's not a ton of stuff this month, but I want to see Elusive Target Arcade. All right, they're actually keeping everything they put on here permanent. They're not rotating it. This guy again, and this woman again. This is kind of the same as, uh, anyway. This guy again. They're just reusing the same handful of contracts. Why is that? Right, let's try this one. They're keeping the complications. I thought you said they were getting rid of those. Ah. Uh, I thought I thought people said they got rid of them. It's just dawned on me while editing this that I think they might be doing this because they want to re-release every contract here several times. I'm not sure if there's only a handful of elusive targets that they've built to actually work in Hitman 3, and a lot of those classic ones just might not be in there. I, I don't know why. Like, you have more than enough of these to not have to reuse ones you've already put in there. They're just putting the complications, the little rules and stuff in there as a means of saying that, oh, this is different from the other time because like, the rules are different, so you need to play it differently. Ugh, come on, Ayo. Clients would prefer that Chesterfield's guide not become collateral damage. That's very specific. I'm not allowed to pacify them or I fail the mission. So what do you want me to do? Just just leave them alone? Did I attempt this one? I can't even remember. All right, Terence Chesterfield. Your wee beady eyes and ginormous forehead. His hair looks like it's peeled up like Velcro. Right now, I, I have... Right, wait, what's going on? What's happening? Welcome to Berlin. Oh, right, okay, eventually. <laughs> Your target is currently on site conducting one of his special inspections. After mm. a whistleblower reported the club's many code violations, his escort, Marion Keane, happens to be the daughter of one of his victims. Uh, the clients have offered a bonus if she makes it through the night unharmed. All right, then. Well, we're in. I got a hobby knife right away. All right, then. So, uh, where, where actually? Oh, yeah, of course, a list of targets. It doesn't just tell you where they are. That's fine, we can try and go about our business the usual way. I'm not gonna get spotted here, am I? There are, there are quite a lot of people around, but... Uh, <laughs> no one looks up. All right, now I gotta be careful, even though I'm, I'm being seen through a wall, fantastic. They can see me through a wall, through a balaclava. The balaclava is completely worthless. I, I do want my stuff, so uh, let's go and get that at the very least that is just up here. Okay, just hanging out by the stairs. I should have picked a better a better spot for this to be hidden, but you know what? It's fine. Right then, so I did uh, I did come strapped today. We we brought a Seeger 300 just in case. Just just in case, you know. Sometimes you just could use a Seeger 300, you know. Right now there is this guy at the top of the stairs. But that is where this comes in. Oh no, they're not shit shit shit. Restart, restart, restart. Forgot I'm not letting knock anyone out. To Berlin 47. <laughs> Your target is currently on site conducting. I forgot all about the rules. I mean it, that's just kind of where it goes right here. God damn it man. Ugh. It's part of the reason why I hate the rules just being there. I just want to play the game, but there's always like, you can't do this and you can't do that. Like, okay, cool. I guess I'll try and have fun. Like, the fun is optional. It did say it would insta-fail, didn't it? If you pacify more than once, you fail the mission. Oh, one pacify. See, I'm really, I really do need to just learn to read the bloody thing. Good thing it wasn't an insta-fail because I would have insta-bloody failed, wouldn't I? Right, well, that kind of poses a problem. I, I mean, I could go up and take that guy, the guard's disguise at the top of the stairs because I am allowed to do that one knockout but i'm guessing that it wants me to use that one knockout on the person that's walking around with them this person here see i'm assuming because she's there as well 
that he's going to be outside in the garden. It just kind of looks like that in the background. So let me just, I'll go this way. I was wanting to get a high position with my sniper rifle so I could, you know, have a look. But it looks like I'm going to have to get in a wee bit closer. But that's fine. That is fine with me. Just need to be wary of any any other staff guys that might find me suspicious. Right, is this the woman? Oh. It's Terence Chesterfield. Oh. How does it feel to meet a man with a higher body count than your own? Well, I haven't met him yet. He's just kind of there. But does he? Is, is, is you try, is, what are you trying to say, Diana? Do you know how many people I killed? You should know by now how many people I killed. It's, it's a lot of fucking people, okay? The only, the only, only person higher up than me had a had a moustache right within, so... Aye, aye, aye. Now, good thing no one seems to be suspicious of me. He does have a, a guard, so I'm guessing it wants me maybe to knock the guard out with my one pacification. It gives me, I'm allowed one pacification and then gives them two guards or at least two people that walk around with them. Like, amazing stuff. <laughs> okay, so he's gonna go uh, up there. What I've seen, everything's fine up there. No need to head upstairs. Oh, you know, my brother has joint issues too. There's nothing to be ashamed of. What are you blabbering about? I assure you, I'm in perfect health. My mistake. Is he gonna go through then? No. Oh, I thought he was gonna like prove her wrong. Like, see, I can climb these stairs. At least he's, you know, standing upright, unlike this guy. Oh, he is gonna to speak to this oh guy. Oh my god. Is he okay? Are you okay, sir? Do you need an ambulance? Uh, uh, it's my leg. I was gonna get it. I slipped. Oh. Uh, Smells like pennies. Oh, is it even water? There must be a leak somewhere. I in this man's plants. Look at him. He has Shirka written all over him. I bet he does this all the time so he can live off of the settlements for his little accidents. I see this a lot. Oh, oh shit. Is that bone sticking out? Probably a chicken bone from his dinner, kept in his pocket until the moment was right. Wow. Add a little stage blood and voila. Payday. I don't think that's what's happening here, Mr. Chesterfield. I think I have a little more experience in these things than you, dear. Now let's Whoa. keep moving to get home before my shows come on. Oh, well, wait, he needs to get in because Coronation Street's on at half seven and he can't miss that. Fuck this man's legs. All right, well, where's he going to go next? See, what I need to know is his path so I can ambush him. He's not going to go in there, is he? Bathrooms are the most structurally sound. Reinforce everything quite well, so we don't need to waste our time. Mate, you're the inspector. You're actually not doing any. Good day to you, sir. Inspecting. Does he have an actual like schedule when any leaves? Like that would be that would be quite cool if he if he did. Cause then you could try and take him out on his exit. Where's he gone? Is he gonna go back outside? Need some fresh air. Get it quick. Get it quick. See if I can just flick him in here. Okay, well, I can get this guy in here. Which I guess is the guy I should probably try and try and get rid of. You don't wanna You don't wanna get that guy. Huh? Ah. No? Huh? Ah. Guy, what the f I don't know how he didn't see the briefcase. It's it's literally like right there. Do you know what? I could just take the briefcase. I stole that coin. That coin's there. Is, is it because it's too too dark in here or something? Ah, mate, what the fuck? Seriously, this guy. This guy's got something wrong with his brain. Guy, come on. Come on. Uh, not right now, please. See if this door would shut. There we go. Right. Now, I'm not allowed to eliminate the guide, but I'm also not allowed to pacify them because the mission will just end. In fact, it would be better to shoot them than it would be to actually knock them out because I can still finish the mission if I if I shoot them. Where did he go though? I, I took way too long trying to try to deal with him. He went on this bridge before. Ah, oh, no. 
Yeah, mate, you seen an old man with back problems? I'm, I, I'm, I'm looking for somebody. He's wearing a high vis. Loves Coronation Street. <laughs> Oh, there he is. Okay. Oh no, what was that? What do you think that noise was? You should go see. No problem. Aye. There's way too many people here. Nothing. Nothing. Do you? So strange. What's wrong with your eyes, man? Is your balaclava fucking blocking your peripheral vision? Like a Metal Gear Solid 1 guard? You can only oh, see that? about seven feet. Hold on, can I open this? No, I can only scale. Hmm, this could work. Alright, we're gonna gonna go and steal some car batteries, hopefully, from the car park out here. What you, what you got for me? Surely there's one, right? Aha! Nice, cool. Hold on. Let's see what happens here. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's see what happens here. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. What about you? You know what? I'm just holding the sheet. Check it out? All right. Yeah, yeah, you you do that, right, okay. Hey, wait up. Just wait a damn second. What follow? Yeah! Oh what? Compromise how? Target eliminated. Oh, I didn't realise that they would actually hold on to me that quickly. Now let's hope the fire exits are up to code 47. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I could have went back and got that guy's keys, but I... Oh, no. It says engaging, but I don't... I don't think they are. Why can't I just leave in this direction? Yeah, I kind of, I kind of rushed that a little bit. Uh, I should have tried to go up on top of the, the container or something. You know, we, we did get him. <laughs> That's all that matters. You know, the thing is, I threw it too early. He, he walked into it, like, two seconds after I threw the car battery into it. <laughs> and nothing was accomplished. Three stars, middle of the road. Alright, now we've got Alison Moretta. I'm allowed to do one pacification again. Have I ever got anybody with proximity semtex? This is probably a terrible decision. I would definitely knock someone out, wouldn't I? I would probably... That's probably a bad idea. Let's not do that. I will get someone with some of that though in future. Maybe the next target if we don't have one of those rules attached. Let's try and go up with a concealable knife, right? I'm only allowed to start in the atrium lobby. So I'll take the concealable knife, electronic key card, and if things get dicey, a silenced assault rifle. Boom. <laughs> the reason I'm putting together like loadouts like that is just to try out different stuff, you know? If you bring different tools, you might get different outcomes. To the Burj Al -Ghazali. Probably failure, Your that's the different is outcome. Currently in the atrium with her mark, millionaire art collector Charles Ogilvy. Sir, Be aware that Loretta is extremely shit. skilled at reading a situation. She's likely to notice anyone who seems out of place. Mm. And if she feels like something's amiss with her mark or her cover, she may flee the area. If anyone's fit for this challenge, Agent 47, uh. it's you. Uh. Hmm. Well, I did bring a concealable knife. You know what? Do we do? We, you know, no pistol, right? We've not, we've not got a pistol. We're gonna do this. All right, fuckers. Frisk me. Get over me. Right? Don't be touching nothing. You shouldn't. I like that spy stuff. Of that fucking spy stuff, ah! Eh? What colour clothes she wearing? She's got purple and black. I did. Oh, there she is, right there. I, I did this one, didn't I? On the channel. It's hard to remember when that when you know you do it once about a year ago. That's absurd. Look at you. You'll bury us all. All right. That is Alison Moretta. Be careful. She has an eye for faces. I've got a face for eyes. I don't know what that means. Right here, mate. Hey, hen. Yeah, I guess I'm organs. Okay. Hey, mate, you ate your fucking you tongue. smell it? I had beans, and I think they oh. were off. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking voice line is so weird, man. <laughs> oh yeah, I dropped. Did I drop a, a chandelier on her? I think that's what I did. 
No, I smuggled in an assault rifle, but it is uh, nowhere near here. It's in the penthouse, which is not very that that useful, to be honest. Now, I take your disguises sometimes, don't I? I'm just gonna take a big smelly shite right now, guy. Okay, all right. I'm just gonna just gonna get out of that bathroom, right? <laughs> right, man, you go. You should really be telling one of these guys to deal with it, but you know, he wants to. Oh. Ah. Take your time, you're, Miss Moretta. You're not meant to like clean it up. What? But, did Forty Seven just say something? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, mate, that's my bathroom there. You know, gonna bulge it in front of me. You know, you're gonna come in here and sit down in the bathroom. I don't understand at all. Oh, come the fuck on. Really? Wait till he's facing forwards. And then just grab him. Right, cool. There we go. We have only had one pacification, didn't we? Well, we have chosen this man's disguise. Is that her there? Okay. Oh, it is. Oh, she's coming in here. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Yeah, she doesn't find me suspicious. <laughs> she, she here. Everything's fine. I didn't even know she came in here. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I was a chance there, wasn't it? I was a fucking chance guy, wasn't it? Now, I can get into that area now. But there are like four other people in that area. Join the viewer. What make your fucking mug? I don't want to see that shit. Nonsense. I picked every piece out for him myself. I'm sure he'll be flattered to hear you were interested. Okay, she's gonna go up here, I think, yeah. I think that's where I found her when I did this mission originally. Get rid of these. Go. Move, 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 move. No! Go. Wonder what happened there? Appreciate a less flashy route. You really know your way around. Uh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Ah, uh, get back down. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. I'm not letting knock anyone out. This is an issue. I'm just gonna get down here and walk. As quick as I can before that guy comes out, sees me, and tries to machine gun me to death for standing out here. Okay. Okay, he's behind a wall. Ah, no. Shit, no. Get. Don't. Oh, somehow he didn't actually spot me, like, properly. Uh, I got away with that, I think. What's he doing? Please don't come over here. Ah. <laughs> uh, kind of just winging it here. I really shouldn't have settled for this stupid guard disguise. But we're going to do it. Oh, oh. Right. Okay. I can't make it past here. Oh, shit. It's fine. It's fine. Alright. Well, my assault rifle is up here. So, that may come in handy. I'm not allowed to knock this guy out. I always knock this guy out. Oh well. Okay. Where are they? They look at art pieces. Just keep moving. I was about to move there. Go. Go. Shit. No. Go. 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 Ah, shit. The fact that I can't knock anyone out, it's 
stops me from doing anything at all. Is there a thing? I can hide in that. I can hide in that. Ah, oh, shit. Whoa. You have to die, guy. You have to die. No, I can't. This I can't, can I? I? Okay, okay. It's time. Get it out. Get it out. I lost sight of suspect. Anyone see him? <laughs> He's shooting at us. Get down. Okay. It has to. Oh, my game crashed. Why? Oh, no, it didn't. It didn't. Okay. Oh. Okay. I don't need. I don't need to shoot you. All right. Ah. Oh, guess. We just gotta try and. <laughs> I just want to complete it. This woman hasn't noticed anything's up. For some reason. Uh, she might raise the alarm though. I'm sorry. Right. Now, technically I have actually contained this. <laughs> we just have to clean it up before uh, anyone comes around. I can take this man's disguise, which is good. But maybe I should, maybe I should hold off for a minute. Okay, let me just get this just now. Uh, <coughs> move as fast as possible. Okay. Get them all in here. This is because I, I know that the target does like a little tour of the penthouse. Or at least I, I'm sure she does. You can't just have bodies and fucking machine guns lying about the place. Ah, oh, there's a cupboard right there. Okay. There you go. Nice. Pick up all the machine guns and leave them there. And I uh, can take this man's clothes. And we're good. All right. Nice. <laughs> I thought I was going to have to murder the whole level. But that's fine. That's fine. Now, just to find her again. Aha! Try and get through this and not kill any more people. Okay? Just the target. That's it. Here we are. Oh. Shit. I just realized this guy's still lying out here. Shit. Shit. Now, they might actually come up here. If they do, it would be the perfect opportunity to to take her out. I'll maybe see if I can do it without murdering the other guy as well. It would be very good if they went upstairs. Come on. The artist started working on this piece no, shortly she... after his brother died. Is this she comes up here? Yes, come on. Come on. Yeah. Now, she just has to... Oh, someone cleaned up all the blood. <laughs> well, not all of it. There's still little spots here and there, but... To be honest, they did a pretty good job. <laughs> not, not completely, though. Okay. This one was done by a seven-year-old orangutan named Dora. Remarkable. <laughs> wow. Remarkable guy, uh, huh? Anybody there? Ah, oh, shit. For some reason, if they're like unique NPCs for elusive targets, they don't react to briefcases. Ah, this is where I killed her before, wasn't it? Yeah. I just want her to go this way. Just go this way, please. Shit. This way. Go this way. Okay, that's that's the whole loop. That's that was it. Just gotta tell him about the, the TV again. My hat? What the hell? It represents what? the neglect of the government in his country. Mm. Have you ever seen this? Oh shit! Have you ever seen this shit before? Look at that. Forty-seven is a goddamn magician. Okay, here they come. What? Uh, yeah. So many shots. Wasn't it me, guy holding gun? <laughs> wow, she's seen me through the wall. Hmm. That's pretty strange. Right, okay, I'm sorry, this is a hit. Fuck he's both, alright? Anyway. They were getting on my nerves. Alright then. And I'm gonna take your weird gravity-defying golf club here. Oh, I'm gonna take that. Right, let's do it. 
Three stars. <laughs> Actually, you know, I'm surprised it was as high as three stars. <laughs> how many? How many people was it even anyway? Seven. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. On to the next one. Ah, this bloody guy. I'm allowed to do one pacification again. God damn it. All right, Philo Newcomb. You're gonna get blasted. Bye. I know he's he's done in a barrel room. So we get ourselves. Down there, pretty rapid. Out here by the bins. Can go down the stairs. Brought my special pistol today. No one questioned why I'm just standing here, you know. <laughs> I'm technically not in your territory that I'm not allowed in. So it's okay, but I can just stand here menacingly staring at you. Get into the wee room. And pick up the big one. Sorted. I, 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 by the way, I brought a proximity semtex block as well as the big one. Like I says, we're trying out new things. <laughs> They're not usually tools that I would use. What is this? Microphone? Why, why not? Where's this guy going? Oh, mate, why? There he is. Alright, move. Now, the last time I attracted the guy into this corner and murdered him and somehow no one noticed, but, uh, yeah, there are the guys up there. Now, they, they come down here, and the guy goes out here. I remember. Do you know what? <laughs> there it is. It's down. It's ready. I'm gonna... I'm allowed up these stairs, ain't I? Uh-oh. Oh, shit! He's gonna get a fucking guard. I can't even go over and get it, because it's a proximity bomb. Oh shit! Who's he talking to? He's talking to that guy. Do I try and distract this guy? Away from the bomb? Oh shit, 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 shit. Uh, I'm gonna try and use the big one to prevent this from happening, okay? Right. In there! Oh. No, shit! Oh. Oh well. Hello? Goodbye, good sir. Oh! That is Philo Newcomb. Would it be is, Romeo isn't it? and Estelle. Like, these guys over here. Don't know what happened. Oh, oh man! Something just exploded! My ears Yeah, it was that so man ready. over there. <laughs> okay. Only one of them is going. Why? Right, well, he's going over there. This other guy is just standing there. He's not leaving his post. Hey, what's going on? Tell me, buddy. You need to help me. Some tosser is making a scene. How did they know? Okay. Well. No, 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 no. You guys have fucked up. Or you have fucked up, good sir. Target eliminated. Get her, get her I'm just gonna try and oh, just, just ah. Uh, you don't see shit, guy. No. Oh my fucking god. I just follow behind these. Ah oh, shit. I can't even go out this exit. I need to let these guys move. I can't even go that way. Uh, no. Is there always this many people here? I don't feel like there is. Oh, guy, please don't. I nearly threw it into that guy's head. Go, yeah, go there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Three of the ugliest hits you'll probably ever see. But were they successful? Yes, they were. Three stars. Go. We got a Seeger AR-552 thing. 
Yeah, another machine gun we probably won't use. <laughs> well, I might use it. I can always find ways to use new weaponry. But yeah, so they added those three to the, the elusive target arcade. Let me just see at least what this one is. If you're detected by cameras, destroy or erase evidence. So it's just the same. So that's cool. At least it's just... They had to insist on putting this complication in there, even though, like, it really doesn't affect the game really like if you're recorded okay you need to go and destroy the evidence but usually if you're recorded you need to go and destroy the evidence anyway but i don't know what the other targets uh rules might be for all you know it might just all of them might just be that same rule for all we know all of those three are the exact same rule as well as well as all five of these might all have the same rule for all of them the same way this one was but i don't know i don't know if you want to see me Play these, let me know in the comments down below, and let me know your thoughts on uh, the, the current situation with the uh, elusive target arcade. My thoughts still kind of remain where they were uh, when they first released elusive target arcade, where it feels like a bit of a missed opportunity. Th there should literally just be a grid of all the elusive targets that you can play, and then you can just play them at will and try and set like a good time on them. I don't see what the problem is in doing that, and just let people play them as different versions of each map you know as opposed to forcing you to play the game a certain way because they thought they had a cool idea with a couple of little rules to force you down certain paths i don't know i just don't think it's that great of an idea hitman's meant to be open-ended you can do whatever you want not be constrictive but hopefully i will take that on board eventually they've been very complication and rules heavy when it comes to hitman 3 and i just don't think it's the right route to go down for this game or this series or whatever people just want choice they just want targets that they can kill in all the fanciful ways that are set up around each map that's all they want. New targets mean they go to new areas, meaning you can use new things that are dotted around the map to get the job done. Any constrictions any player has on them, I feel like, need to be self-imposed. And you can play the game and impose the, your own restrictions on yourself if you want to try and play a game, the game in a certain way or whatever. I've done this myself. Play it my own way as opposed to being told to play it a certain way. I don't know. Anyway, but we've had this discussion before, I feel like. So I don't want to just keep going over the same few points over and over again. I'm just hoping I take note there must be some sort of data on how many people are even playing these modes i mean i was top 2000 on a couple of those there and they weren't even good runs anyway i hope you enjoyed if you did don't forget hit the like button leave me a comment for the engagement and all that stuff because youtube needs that for for it to promote your video in any way and uh until next time happy big money and i'll see you guys later goodbye